morning, everyone. How are you today? We made it through our Monday. Let's hear what Minnie has to say this morning. It's 6.33 on this Tuesday morning. Well, I was gonna sleep in today, but that didn't happen and somehow I ended up here earlier than I have been. So that's how my Tuesday's starting. So let's take a quick look at our calendar and then I'm gonna do a throwback story to one that I love to read to my kids when they were little called Froggy Gets Dressed. And although it's about Froggy going out and playing in the snow, and it's supposed to be spring, we're going to have some snow here the next couple of days. Not anything accumulating, but hey, it's northwest, northwest Ohio and it's springtime, so I thought I'd pull a Froggy book out. But first, let's take a look at our calendar. Once again, our month is still April, and April starts with the letter, the letter A. Very good. And today is April 14th. And we didn't count yesterday, so we're going to count today. And our day of the week, as I said, is Tuesday. So let's count our numbers. We're going to count up to 14, and then we're going to count down to 1 and do blast off. So get in your ready position. All right, guys. Are we ready? Begin. 1, 2, 3, 4, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. We ready for our countdown? Ready, begin. Fourteen, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one, blast off. Good deal. Let's put our calendar all together. I'll say it and then you say it like we do in the classroom. So are we ready? Today is Tuesday, April 14th, 2020. Very good. Alrighty, guys. So the story this morning, as I said, is Froggy Gets Dressed. This story was written by Jonathan London, and the pictures were drawn by, or the illustrator, is Frank Remkowitz. Froggy Gets Dressed. <clears throat> Let me clear my throat. <clears throat> I have a frog in it this morning. It was cold. Froggy woke up and looked out the window. Snow, snow, he sang. I want to play in the snow. Go back to sleep, Froggy, said his mother. Don't you know, frogs are supposed to sleep all winter. Wake up when the snow melts. No, no, cried Froggy. I'm awake, awake. I want to go out and play in the snow. So Froggy put on his socks, zoop, pulled on his boots, zup, put on his hat, zat, tied on his scarf, zwip, tugged on his mittens, zoom, and flopped outside into the snow. Flop, flop, flop. Froggy, called his mother. What? yelled Froggy. Did you forget to put something on? Froggy looked down. Oops, cried Froggy. I forgot to put on my pants. I think that would be a little chilly. He flopped back inside, flop, 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 tugged off his mittens, untied his scarf, took off his hat, pulled off his boots. He left his socks on and slipped down his pants. Zip. Then he pulled on his boots, zip, put on his hat, zip, or zat. Tied on his scarf, zwit, tugged on his mitten, zoom, and flopped back outside into the snow. Flop, flop, flop. Froggy, called his mother. What? yelled Froggy. Did you forget to put, on some, put something on? 
Froggy looked down. Oops, he cried. I forgot to put on my shirt. And your coat, added his mother. Moms, what are we going to do? Froggy flopped back inside. Flop, flop, flop. Tugged off his mittens, untied his scarf, took off his hat. He left his pants, boots, and socks on and buttoned up his shirt. Zut, zut, zut. Then he snapped on his coat, snap, put on his hat, zat, tied on his scarf, zwit, tugged on his mitten, zoom, and flopped back outside into the snow. Flop, flop, flop. Froggy, called his mother. What, yelled Froggy. Did you forget to put something on? Froggy looked down. He had on his mittens, he had on his scarf, he had on his coat, he had on his shirt, he had on his pants, he had on his boots, he had on his socks, he reached up, yep, he had on his hat. What could be missing? Hmm. <laughs> Your underwear, his mother laughed. <gasps> Oops, cried Froggy, looking more red in the face than green. Froggy flopped back inside, flop, flop, flop. He tugged off his mittens, untied his scarf, unsnapped his coat, unbuttoned his shirt, unzipped his pants, pulled off his boots, took off his socks. He left his hat on and slipped his long johns on with a zip of elastic. Then he put on one sock, zoop, and pulled on one boot, zoop, tugged on one mitten, zoom, and started to tug on the other and let it drop and said, I'm too tired. And went back to sleep. Good night, Froggy. The end. Have you ever forgot to put your underwear on? Hmm, I don't think I have. So on this Tuesday, don't forget your underwear. Make it a great day, and I'll see you back here tomorrow. Love you guys.